Welcome back to my channel. Today, there is something I need to tell you guys. I feel like you guys really need to know this. So this is a background of what's going on in my life right now, or actually what's been going on for the past six or seven months. And this is about how I first started YouTube. Everything else I feel like you guys need to know, and some changes that I'm going to be making to my YouTube channel. So you guys might know, I love baking. It's been a big hobby for about 10 years. I would bake a lot for special occasions and events, and so many people love my baking. I've also had some people that have trouble with baking. So that's when I've decided to start my own YouTube channel, show people how I bake, and giving great tips to help people with baking. I even went to culinary school for six months, so I also have professional tips for you guys. I started my YouTube channel in January of 2018, so more than four years now. And when I first started, I was very camera shy, and I talked way differently in those videos. Eventually, I got better at talking on camera, and being more enthusiastic. I still talk a little slow in my videos, but once I edit the video, I speed it up slightly so it sounds like I'm talking faster. I also posted a video any day of the week whenever I wanted. And a little more than a year ago, I decided to post three times a week because I'm sure people love frequent uploads. But a couple months later, it's been too much of a stress for me. If you guys don't know this, I also have a job and I work 20 to 38 hours a week. So also having to do YouTube, filming them and editing them is just a lot of work for me. I would usually have to stay up very late at night, usually 2 to 3 in the morning, and sometimes even as late as 5 in the morning. And that just makes me tired all throughout the next day. And now it's been done so much that I'm always tired throughout the day and wide awake at night. So late at night is when I'm most in the mood to do the videos. And it's not something I want to do, because it's affecting of how I work at my job. And it's also been a habit of waiting until the last couple hours of the day to edit the video and upload it for you guys. I try to post every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday. And I'm sure you guys have noticed that the videos are usually uploaded very late, or even for a lot of you, it's already the next day when you're seeing the video. And sometimes I even skip an upload. And if it's a good day, then I'll post a video earlier in the day. And the other thing about posting three times a week is it doesn't give me much time to experiment with recipes and develop ones that are even more astonishing for you guys. If you don't know this, about 99% of my videos I film on camera the first time I ever made it. So a lot of them are quick and easy, and occasionally there would be a great one. And sometimes mistakes happen. If it's a minor mistake, it can usually be easily fixed. If it's a major mistake and can't be fixed, then I would just end up not uploading the video and think of something else to do or I would just refilm it. So in the past, I've done quite a few gluten-free and vegan recipes, and a lot of you guys love those videos, but I didn't get to do one in a long time because I haven't had much time to experiment with them. So with all this stress going on and to develop even better video for you guys, I'm gonna start posting twice a week instead of three times a week. So every Mondays and Thursdays from now on. And if the stress still continues, I may even go down to one video a week. And I'll also try my best to have the video uploaded earlier in the day. So that was today's video. I hope you guys understand all the hard work and stress I go through to make videos for you guys and accepts the new uploading schedule. Subscribe to my channel to see more videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.